Good morning, beautiful people. It is Monday and it is 9 a.m. and we're starting the week over and oh my God, my eyes itch again. I don't know what it is. I feel like I'm getting allergies here. What am I getting allergies against? Anyway, we're about to have our meeting. It is, uh, I think it is 8.08, 8 8.05, two minutes to 9 a.m. And we're supposed, Ricky and me are supposed to meet here at nine. Thank you very much. And I just got my coffee. Um, so I think Ricky is late. So we're gonna give him some shit for being late once he gets here. But um, I mean, how, how mad can you be with your first cup of coffee in the morning? Ooh, this is a strong one. I like it. All right, let's see when Ricky arrives. And depending on how many minutes he is late, I think um, there should be some punishment. Maybe, I'm guessing like, so here's the proposal, right? Let's say, so we're supposed to meet at nine. Let's say he arrives at 9.03, which is three minutes late, right? I think we should cut off three limbs, you know? And if he's late seven minutes, we cut off seven limbs. You know, and he can, I mean, he can even choose what it might be. You know, he can say, you know, like, there could be seven fingers, or it could be two fingers and five toes, or it could be two fingers, three toes, the nose, and an ear. You know, that's up to him. I think we can give him that. But for each more minute that he's late, um, we cut off one more limb. I think that's a good challenge. Look who's coming here. Let's see. It is 9.04 a.m. What do you have to say in your defense, sir? The poop was worth it. The poop was worth it? Yeah. Wow, that must have been an amazing poop then. It was. Well, just to let you know, we just agreed, I mean, they don't know yet because they haven't watched the vlog yet, but we agreed on a punishment because obviously we said 9 a.m. and so there needs to be a punishment for being late. And we thought it might make sense that for every minute you're late, we cut off one limb. So right now, you're, <laughs> you're late four minutes, uh -huh. so we cut off four limbs. That's... And we thought we're nice, which means you can choose what limbs to cut off. For example... So yours. No, it's you definitely said... yours. You but you choose, you choose which ones which of ones. yours. No, 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 you didn't no, no. Say of Let's not con contrude you didn't this. Say of yours. You said, oh, okay, you no, which no, you that's not off. that's yep. not how this works. No. <laughs> you can well, choose. You have to specify. For example, you can say four fingers. Mm -hmm. You could say two fingers and two toes. You could say one finger, one toe, my nose, and that's one ear. Nose is in the limb. Oh yeah, it's limb. It's oh. hanging off your body. <laughs> Alright, so then I'll do two of you. No, no. Okay, shit, we forgot one major part in this. <laughs> okay, then next time, we establish next time. It's all in the wording. Yeah, next time your limbs okay, are getting limbs. cut off. Okay. Your limbs. N yeah, no, yeah, your, your, not mine. Your. No, yours. Your. Yours. Your limbs. But not mine. Not mine. Yes, no, wait. It's yours, yours but not mine. Ex ex no, but not from your perspective. Like, if I say it, it's like from my perspective to you. So it's your limbs. Your limbs, not Ricky's mine. limbs. That's better. Yours there we go. Somewhere. Now we found, found Who, the lawyer. Which Ricky? Ricky Somborn. There's a couple. Uh, so as you guys know, yesterday unfollowed, I unfollowed everyone on um, Instagram, like I think 1,200 people. And um, well, one, my, my DMs are completely spammed right now of people asking me why. And I think I went into it yesterday a bit and I'm gonna make a like more sit down video, but really it wasn't like a big, oh my God, let me make a pro and contra list and here are the pro list, here, here are the points why it's good and why it's bad. And then I made like the, it was just like in the moment, I felt inspired, I felt in the mood, I, I played with the thought earlier and I just like, I followed up and so, I unfollowed everyone, I'm gonna see how it has an impact, if it has an impact, what it's gonna to do to me. Um, but one thing that I realized yesterday, what, which was super interesting was, 
Um, well, when I had that thought, I was like sitting on the balcony, I was like reading some article or something, listening to some music. So, you know, you, you're in the mood of like doing things. And so when I had that idea of like, huh, might be cool to unfollow everyone, I immediately went into my Instagram and started unfollowing everyone from the top down. Like not thinking about it, not like filtering, not like, oh, what about this person? What about this person? Like literally just starting to unfollow. And I continued doing that until I got blocked. And I think I could unfollow 800 people of my 1200 people that I was following. And then I got blocked because Instagram doesn't want you apparently to unfollow too many people too fast. Um, and so I had to take a break. And I think two hours later I got unblocked and I still had like 450 people left who um, I was following and who I had to unfollow. And so I started unfollowing again and literally two hours after you know I made the decision and after I was so convinced that this is what I wanna do and after I already like unfollowed two thirds of everyone I was unfollowing, I was, I was finally like getting back into it and I was like, the fuck am I doing right now? Like I was looking at the people I was unfollowing and I was like, oh my god, I really like this person, and oh my god, this is a good friend, what might they think if I unfollow them, and oh my god, I really want to keep up with them, and you know, some people are in there who, you know, you're not super close connected, and Instagram is literally the only connection you have. I mean, all my friends that I have in my, in my like, um, contacts list, like, I'm not super worried about, because I can always go back and follow them again if I decide to do that. But um, some people, like, I might never find them again. I might never remember them anymore. And um, so I had these doubts. And it's just so interesting. Um, two hours after I made the decision. And that, to me, just showed again how important it is that if you have a thought, if you have an idea, if you want to do something, if you feel inspired, you have to go immediately in there and do the first step and do the first thing. Because I know... Like, just from that, if I would have sat there on the balcony and I made the decision of like, yeah, this is what I want to do, and then I'm like, but you know, I don't have the five or 10 minutes right now, let me take a note in my to-do list and do it tomorrow. And then tomorrow I'm gonna unfollow everyone. I promise you, the chance of me actually unfollowing everyone, if that's what I would have done, is, um, I don't know, decreased by half or something. Um, and so, if you have an idea, if you want to do something, if you feel inspired, make sure that you at least take, take the very first small step towards that goal or what you want to do right away and don't wait and don't put it on a to-do list and say tomorrow when I have the time, like do it right now because you need to use this energy of the inspiration to actually make the step to do it. That's just something that I realized from yesterday. Hey, um, I just wanted to share one thing because Ricky just got bit by a mosquito right under his eye. It's really annoying. You are really annoying. Sometimes. I mean, sometimes? That's, I mean, I'd rather say most of the time, to be honest. I'm, I'm not even gonna respond to that. You just responded to it. That's gross. I mean, your face? My eye. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, look at the sunset. <laughs> look at it. <laughs> oh, 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 shit. Why is it not... Oh, come on, come on. Go a bit low. Okay, it's not really nice looking on here. But it looks pretty nice, like, to be honest. You just don't see it. You don't know? <laughs> Should we do comment of the day now? Yeah. All right, let's do comment of the day. Right, comment of the day goes to two people, Lana Fallon and Noah. Oh, I love you guys together. Your girlfriend is so nice and your girlfriend is dope. Any person who ever uh, compliments my girlfriend gets a shout out of the day. Well, maybe I shouldn't say that because, well, it's still a good thing because you guys are right. So shout out to you guys. Also, I love both of you guys. Lana, Noah, I love you. <laughs> How's your eye doing, Ricky? <laughs> Good. Can I see it? <laughs> Please show it. Come on, show it. I mean, it's a little bit like... <laughs>
Wow. That's, the, that's the most annoying. That's the most annoying mosquito bite I've ever seen on a yeah. human. It's a, except on a tongue. Have you ever had one on your tongue? No. Yeah, that's weird. I never had. Literally one. just got bit by like five, five less than five minutes ago, and it's like <laughs> swelling. I'm allergic to mosquitoes. Anytime a mosquito bites me, it like. Well, stop putting your finger on it. You, you not no. Yeah, you can do that, but don't touch it. Okay, good. All right, guys. Signing off the vlog now. It was a good day. Got some good things done. Anastasia's kind of getting sick, so that's not good. Look who's coming here. Small Waldo. Um, I'm liking the Instagram thing so far. I'm liking it. I mean, you know, we're experimenting. The, the experiment of the how life is after unfollowing everyone is going to continue tomorrow. Actually, tomorrow I'm going to Chengdu for particular one meeting with a potential client, but also meeting a couple other people, meeting Nicholas again. Yeah, so exciting day tomorrow with a long scooter drive to Shanggu. So see you tomorrow. And peace out. I love you. Hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up. See